We really need to look after our water in Essex because if we don't, with these longer hot summers, it's going to have consequences for us all. We are one of the driest counties, so what we need to do is build more resilience in how we use water. We're investing in a really big project, bringing a big pipeline from North Lincolnshire down to Colchester, taking from an area where there's surplus water and delivering it to an area where there's a need for water, and that's Essex. We have a strategy about being net zero organisation by 2030, so we've got lots of ways we're doing that. We're looking at renewable energy to help power our sites, education of our customers, and we're also uh, decarbonising our fleet. We're asking our customers to shower and keep it to five minutes. And basically, if all of our customers do that, we could save over 100 million litres a day. We've also got a strategy to try and minimise pollution where it happens and before it happens. So we're encouraging our customers to report pollutions to us when they find them through Pollution Watch, which is an online app. Green infrastructure, land use, nature-based solutions such as wetlands and tree planting are all part of the solution to try and meet this challenge. So we spent hundreds of millions of pounds increasing our resilience. That's to make sure we protect and improve the environment for generations to come. We've also got our wetlands projects as well to create biodiversity sites for nature to thrive to really put rivers at the back of the heart of the community and, and make them places to visit. So conserve your water, look after it and make it count and only use it when you really have to use it.